A lot of slippers. In Dallas Wednesday, Darren Woodson retired after 13 seasons in the NFL, during which he became the all-time leading tackler in Cowboys history. Woodson's retirement had been expected since he didn't play, let alone practice, all year long. The last player on the Cowboys roster to have played in all three of their Super Bowls back in the 90s had back surgery three days before the season and could not return. Now, he's retired. It was special to, to put that helmet on. It was special to have that star on the side of, of my helmet. And knowing every time I went out there, you know, people were going to give us their best shot. And I don't care if we were Super Bowl champs the year before or if we were 5-11, and 11, you are going to get the other team's best shot. And uh, that's special. That's saying something about your organization. Unselfish, reliable, uh, dependable, a team player first, and a, and a team leader always. When I put that helmet on again, I laid it on the line for you guys, and not only for, for this team, but for, for everybody that was out there, my family, the Joneses, uh, the, the, the other players that are out there. I laid it on the line every time I put that helmet on. In addition to the franchise best 1,350 tackles, Woodson went to five Pro Bowls in his career, all in a row from 94 to 98. He retires with three Super Bowl rings, leaving Larry Allen as the only player on the Cowboys active roster to have played in their last Super Bowl in 95. Woodson is the only player, period, to have bridged the Jimmy Johnson and Bill Parcells eras in Dallas.